Hi there, great to see you again. Uh, today we're going to take a quick look at how I edit videos and how I make videos, short form videos in CapCut. Um, and uh, let's get into it and we'll have a look now. So if I open up CapCut, uh, now you see I've got one project saved. So uh, if I open up that project, now we can see inside that project there's only one soundtrack. Now that soundtrack is a motivational soundtrack. Let's just have a listen to it for a minute. Okay, so we've got one soundtrack. Now what I do is I have a bank of uh, motivational and inspirational videos. So uh, these are some of them. Uh, so what we do is those videos you can actually get hold of those videos on uh, uh, websites like Fiverr etc very cheaply or, or you can go to my website robhillman.au um, and sign up for a free account and you'll get some freebies on that site as well uh, so what we'll do is we'll just pick one of these videos and we'll drag it into the media bucket so uh, now the preset is already set for uh, YouTube Shorts or uh, TikTok videos, so um, it's a very simple process. Let's just drag the main video file down into the uh, timeline. Now we can see that the audio is just too long, so we'll drag it back until we see that line and let it go. Now let's have a look and see how that's going to sound. I'm not afraid to fail. I'm not afraid to fall over, make a mistake. That often. So, uh, I won't watch it all the way through, but I just watched the first few seconds uh, to get an idea of what I'm going to actually call that video. So, uh, if I now go up to the export button and export it, you can see I can give this video a title. So, I'll give this title um, Don't Be afraid to fail. Now uh, an interesting thing happens, I've got uh, my search parameters uh, in my CapCut go to this folder here and as you can see there's uh, nothing in that folder at the moment so uh, except for a few of those folders but the videos uh, will end up here so let's just move that aside. So the minute I hit export what it does is it sends that video to my CapCut Saves folder. So that's the video there. Now, uh, also, it's giving us an opportunity to share this video in TikTok or YouTube directly. Now, um, I don't normally uh, do it automatically here. So if I cancel that uh, and then I'll delete this folder, this file, I'll delete. I'm not that afraid. Folder. And then let's make another video. So I'll drag it in there, drag that down to the timeline. Now this is a lot longer, so let me just drag the audio out and then drag that back and then just let's see what this is. What is, is the one be. thing that has surprised you about your life? Oh, one thing. Okay, so uh, let's call this the one thing. So I'll export it, give it a name again. The one thing and then uh, as you can see at the moment there's only one video in there so if I export it it saves it straight away and then I can instead of sharing it I'll cancel it get into the uh, video file cancel that what delete is that delete that drag another one in uh, and then drag that down to the timeline uh, I'll scrunch the timeline down a bit, move the audio out, drag that back. Let's see what this Every one Every time is. I got around my being there, buddies, I was more like, um, it's cool to come over your house, but. Okay, so we'll export that one, give that a name. Uh, I was more like, and just leave it. So let's leave it. Let's export that. We'll cancel that and straight away within a couple of minutes we've got three videos all ready to go. So uh, 
let me just open that what one is up. the one thing that has surprised you about your life oh one thing wow well i certainly i'm surprised by the whole thing honestly <laughs> <laughs> I certainly didn't expect to be to be uh, so that, these things to happen. That video turned out okay. So, uh, look, it's a, just a simple process. And once I've I upload them directly to YouTube, so I'll uh, highlight these three directly, upload them to YouTube, and then once I've finished uploading them, I'll drag all three into my CapCut Drafts folder for TikTok. So, um, I then they're the right size for TikTok as well but I use uh, YouTube shorts at the moment but that's a very fast and uh, quick way to edit videos I hope you've enjoyed the, uh, the video uh, if so just click a like and uh, subscribe uh, more to come thanks a lot talk soon